Welcome to Life Song Meditation and Prayer. Deep meditative sounds for peace and tranquility. If you find this meditation spiritually soothing, feel free to subscribe. Now, relax your mind and spirit. Let the words I speak of life and hope penetrate into your heart, mind, and soul. We love because he first loved us. No one has ever seen God, but if we love one another, God lives in us and his love is made complete in us. And over all these virtues put on love, which binds them all together in perfect unity. Above all, love each other deeply because love covers over a multitude of sins. But love your enemies, do good to them, and lend to them without expecting to get anything back. Then your reward will be great, and you will be children of the Most High, because he is kind to the ungrateful and wicked. Love is patient, love is kind. It does not envy, it does not boast, it is not proud. Husbands, love your wives, just as Christ loved the church and gave himself up for her. Dear children, let us not love with words or speech, but with actions and in truth. Hatred stirs up conflict, but love covers over all wrongs. Beloved, let us love one another, for love is from God, and whoever loves has been born of God and knows God. Be kind and compassionate to one another, forgiving each other just as in Christ God forgave you. Whoever does not love does not know God, because God is love. Let no 
debt remain outstanding, except the continuing debt to love one another, for whoever loves others has fulfilled the law. My command is this, love each other as I have loved you. Above all, love each other deeply, because love covers over a multitude of sins. Love must be sincere. Hate what is evil, cling to what is good. Be completely humble and gentle, be patient, bearing with one another in love. There is no fear in love, but perfect love drives out fear because fear has to do with punishment. The one who fears is not made perfect in love. Do everything in love. Dear friends, let us love one another, for love comes from God. Everyone who loves has been born of God and knows God. Love does not delight in evil but rejoices with the truth. Above all, love each other deeply because love covers over a multitude of sins. Let love and faithfulness never leave you, bind them around your neck, write them on the tablet of your heart. And now these three remain, faith, hope, and love. But the greatest of these is love. A new command I give you, love one another. As I have loved you, so you must love one another. Draw near to God, and He will draw near to you.
but for me, it is good to be near God. I have made the Lord God my refuge. Let us draw near with a true heart and full assurance of faith. My heart says of you, seek his face. Your face, Lord, I will seek. The Lord is near to all who call on him, to all who call on him in truth. Seek the Lord while he may be found, call on him while he is near. You will seek me and find me when you seek me with all your heart. You make known to me the path of life, in your presence there is fullness of joy. But seek first the kingdom of God and his righteousness. As the deer pants for streams of water, so my soul pants for you, my God. Honestly, I seek you, my soul thirsts for you. Blessed are those who keep his testimonies, who seek him with their whole heart. I will give them a heart to know that I am the Lord, and they shall be my people. I love those who love me, and those who seek me find me. My soul yearns for you in the night, my spirit within me earnestly seeks you. The Lord is with you while you are with him.
that they should seek God and perhaps feel their way toward him and find him. But from there you will seek the Lord your God and you will find him if you search after him with all your heart and with all your soul. So for yourselves righteousness, reap steadfast love, break up your fallow ground, for it is the time to seek the Lord, that he may come and reign righteous. Ask, and it will be given to you, seek and you will find, knock, and it will be open to you. He who dwells in the shelter of the Most High will abide in the shadow of the Almighty. Let the wicked forsake his way, and the unrighteous man his thoughts. Let him return to the Lord, that he may have compassion on him, and to our God, for he will freely forgive. With my whole heart I seek you. Let me not wander from your commandments. I entreat your favor with all my heart, be gracious to me according to your promise. The young lions suffer want and hunger, but those who seek the Lord lack no good thing. Let love be without hypocrisy. Abhor what is evil. Cling to what is good. These three remain, faith, hope, and love. But the greatest of these is love. Love your neighbor as yourself. Be completely humble and gentle, be patient, bearing with one another in love. For God so loved the world that he gave his one and only Son, 
that whoever believes in him shall not perish, but have eternal life. Let all that you do be done in love. Beloved, if God so loved us, we also ought to love one another. Love is the fulfillment of the law. Love your enemies and pray for those who persecute you. There is no greater love than to lay down one's life for one's friends. Love your enemies, do good to them, and lend to them without expecting to get anything back. Then your reward will be great, and you will be children of the Most High, because he is kind to the ungrateful and wicked. Dear friends, since God so loved us, we also ought to love one another. Hatred stirs up conflict, but love covers all wrongs. loves at all times, and a brother is born for adversity. Love your neighbor as yourself. There is no commandment greater than these. May the Lord make your love increase and overflow for each other and for everyone else, just as ours does for you. Be devoted to one another in love. Honor one another above yourselves. But I say to you who hear, love your enemies, do good to those who hate you. In this is love, 
not that we have loved God but that he loved us and sent his son to be the propitiation for our sins. The goal of this command is love, which comes from a pure heart and a good conscience and a sincere faith. No one has ever seen God, but if we love one another, God lives in us and his love is made complete in us. Love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul and with all your mind and with all your strength. Let love and faithfulness never leave you, bind them around your neck, write them on the tablet of your heart. Above all, love each other deeply, because love covers over a multitude of sins. May the Lord direct your hearts into God's love and Christ's perseverance. May the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace as you trust in him so that you may overflow with hope by the power of the Holy Spirit. For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans to prosper you and not to harm you plans to give you hope and a future. But those who hope in the Lord will renew their strength. They will soar on wings like eagles, they will run and not grow weary, they will walk and not be faint. My soul, are you downcast? Why so disturbed within me? Put your hope in God, for I will yet praise him, my Savior and my God. Now faith is confidence in what we hope for and assurance about what we do not see. For in this hope we were saved. But hope that is seen is no hope at all. Who hopes for what they already have?
The Lord is my portion, therefore I will hope in him. But as for me, I will always have hope, I will praise you more and more. But blessed is the one who trusts in the Lord, whose confidence is in him. I wait for the Lord, my whole being waits, and in his word, I put my hope. For I am the Lord your God who takes hold of your right hand and says to you, Do not fear, I will help you. I have set the Lord always before me, because he is at my right hand, I shall not be shaken. But now, Lord, what do I look for? My hope is in you. Guide me in your truth and teach me, for you are God my Savior, and my hope is in you all day long. But as for me, I watch and hope for the Lord, I wait for God my Savior, my God will hear me. The Lord is with you while you are with him. Find rest, O my soul, in God alone, my hope comes from him. The hope of the righteous brings joy, but the expectation of the wicked will perish. You are my refuge and my shield, I have put my hope in your word. But you, God, see the trouble of the afflicted, you consider their grief and take it in hand. The victims commit themselves to you, you are the helper of the fatherless. He will wipe every tear from their eyes. 
There will be no more death or mourning or crying or pain, for the old order of things has passed away. May your unfailing love be with us, Lord, even as we put our hope in you. I pray that the eyes of your heart may be enlightened in order that you may know the hope to which he has called you, the riches of his glorious inheritance in his holy people. The hope of the righteous shall be gladness, but the expectation of the wicked shall perish. Blessed be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ. According to his great mercy, he has caused us to be born again to a living hope through the resurrection of Jesus Christ from the dead. Now faith is confidence in what we hope for and assurance about what we do not see. Without faith, it is impossible to please God, because anyone who comes to him must believe that he exists and that he rewards those who earnestly seek him. But when you ask, you must believe and not doubt because the one who doubts is like a wave of the sea, blown and tossed by the wind. I can do all this through him who gives me strength. So we fix our eyes not on what is seen, but on what is unseen since what is seen is temporary, but what is unseen is eternal. For we live by faith, not by sight. Trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding. Have faith in God. Therefore, I tell you, whatever you ask for in prayer, believe that you have received it, and it will be yours.
For God has not given us a spirit of fear, but of power and of love and of a sound mind. And Jesus answered them, Truly, I say to you, if you have faith and do not doubt, you will not only do what has been done to the fig tree, but even if you say to this mountain, be taken up and thrown into the sea, it will happen. Jesus said to her, did I not tell you that if you believed you would see the glory of God? For everyone born of God overcomes the world. This is the victory that has overcome the world, even our faith. Therefore I tell you, whatever you ask for in prayer, believe that you have received it, and it will be yours. And Jesus said to him, Go, your faith has made you well. Immediately he regained his sight and followed him on the way. So faith comes from hearing, and hearing through the word of Christ. in faith, with no doubting, for the one who doubts is like a wave of the sea that is driven and tossed by the wind. For in it the righteousness of God is revealed from faith for faith, as it is written, the righteous shall live by faith. And whatever you ask in prayer, you will receive, if you have faith. Be on your guard, stand firm in the faith, be courageous, be strong. And Jesus said to him, if you can, all things are possible for one who believes. But you, dear friends, by building yourselves up in your most holy faith and praying in the Holy Spirit, and 
Jesus answered them, Truly, I say to you, if you have faith and do not doubt, you will not only do what has been done to the fig tree, but even if you say to this mountain, be taken up and thrown into the sea, it will happen. For the righteous will never be moved, he will be remembered forever. But the one who endures to the end will be saved. I can do all this through him who gives me strength. The Lord is my strength and my shield, my heart trusts in him, and he helps me. My heart leaps for joy, and with my song, I praise him. But those who hope in the Lord will renew their strength. They will soar on wings like eagles, they will run and not grow weary, they will walk and not be faint. God is our refuge and strength an ever-present help in trouble. The Lord is my strength and my defense. He has become my salvation. Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid, do not be discouraged, for the Lord your God will be with you wherever you go. The Lord is my strength and my song, he has become my salvation. Fear not, for I am with you, be not dismayed, for I am your God, I will strengthen you, I will help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. But the Lord stood at my side and gave me strength. Be strong and take heart, all you who hope in the Lord.
he gives strength to the weary and increases the power of the weak. I love you, Lord, my strength. The Lord is my light and my salvation, whom shall I fear? The Lord is the stronghold of my life, of whom shall I be afraid? The Lord is my strength and my defense, he has become my salvation. You are my hiding place and my shield, I hope in your word. The Lord is my strength and my song, he has given me victory. But as for me, I watch and hope for the Lord, I wait for God my Savior, my God will hear me. I will strengthen you and help you, I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid or terrified because of them, for the Lord your God goes with you. He will never leave you nor forsake you. I sought the Lord, and He answered me, He delivered me from all my fears. The Lord is my strength and my shield, my heart trusts in Him, and He helps me. So do not fear, for I am with you, do not be dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you and help you, I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. But the Lord is faithful, and he will strengthen you and protect you from the evil one. But those who hope in the Lord will renew their strength. They will soar on wings like eagles, they will run and not grow weary, they will walk and not be faint. Be 
on your guard, stand firm in the faith, be courageous, be strong. For everyone born of God overcomes the world. This is the victory that has overcome the world, even our faith. For in this hope, we were saved. But hope that is seen is no hope at all. Who hopes for what they already have? I say to you, if you have faith as a mustard seed, you will say to this mountain, move from here to there and it will move, and nothing will be impossible for you. Therefore, since we have been justified through faith, we have peace with God through our Lord Jesus Christ. When you ask, you must believe and not doubt, because the one who doubts is like a wave of the sea, blown and tossed by the wind. For in Christ Jesus, neither circumcision nor uncircumcision has any value. The only thing that counts is faith expressing itself through love. And Jesus answered them, Truly, I say to you, if you have faith and do not doubt, you will not only do what has been done to the fig tree, but even if you say to this mountain, be taken up and thrown into the sea, it will happen. I can do all this through him who gives me strength. Without faith, it is impossible to please God, because anyone who comes to Him must believe that He exists and that He rewards those who earnestly seek Him. Thank you for listening to Life Song Meditation and Prayer. Deep meditative quotes and sounds for peace and tranquility. Our prayer is that these verses of faith, hope, and love bring you comfort and solitude, reminding you of the promises and unfailing love of God. If you found this one hour of meditation spiritually soothing, feel free to like and subscribe to our channel. May the Lord bless you.